I, you always meet someone that you actually think you might want to date when you're like so good on your own and you're so not wanting a relationship like I was I met him when I was having like a crazy weekend with my friends where we were going out every single we had like a bunch it was like we had a clothing launch and Mm -hmm. then a birthday and then a concert and we had all these things in one weekend so we were like let's just like go crazy and hang out and like get party buses for every day and just like have a weekend and so I was in the middle of this crazy weekend and I met this guy and then we started hanging out and he I was like oh my god like what I like this kid is so cool he we went on a date he lives like so we went to sunset tower he lives like right over there like in in west yeah. hollywood he drove all the way to sherman oaks to come to pick, pick me up. up and drive me just back to go to the restaurant and then at 3 a.m drove me back home because i don't, didn't want to sleep over like every single day every time we hung out we were we've spent the last like 11 days together every single day and he's driven me home like like pays for every meal not that that matters no, but, but like he's courteous it's just, it's and kind and like, chivalrous he would like open the ca- get out of the car and like open the car door for so you're just, telling like, me little... logan wouldn't do that no logan would be like get an uber to my house <laughs> 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 if you feel like it which is like it's fine it's we're not in a relationship he doesn't owe me anything like I, I that's why i feel like logan and i are it's just a friend thing like we're mm-hmm. not it's not like that um and i mean if he grew up and wanted that maybe it could be maybe but i don't know if i want that with him like he's just not I don't, he's not that guy like meeting this new guy has just really made me think like what do you really want like maybe i could be with someone if they are like this amazing yeah, he like, has 15 dogs and he like rescues them from being killed wait what Who oh, that's he? the greatest thing you've said so far wait what who is this person would we know him uh no and he you is like normal that? and he is in like finance oh we love this <laughs> yeah He's great. And you hung out with him for 11 days straight and you're not sick of him? That's incredible. Oh, you're in. You're both in. You probably are like, that's that's like a cool high. That's like a cool relationship It's so fun, on. but then I'm like, oh my God, what if like we hang out every single day and then we just start hating each other randomly one day? Because I mean, we're, we're in such a like moment right now. Like every time we go out, we're like all over each other, like very like PDA, like disgusting, which is so not me. And I never like to cuddle, but like I always want to cuddle him. He's the only guy that's ever slept in my bed at my house. I never have people sleep over in my house. I I hate it. I like I'm, I'm very I told you about my OCD. I'm really weird about my bed. He slept in my bed two nights in a row and I like literally was fine with it. What? I know. These are telling signs. I know, it was crazy. Has he seen you perform? No. Cuz I haven't performed in the last 11 days. <laughs> Cuz you literally only know He him sent for that me long. he sent me a what? giant bouquet of roses after we just cuz we were like okay, we're having a streak like we we are we're seeing each other every single day until he just left. He's in Montana right now, but he was like we're seeing each other every single day. My god, does he like vacation in Montana? Does he live there? Family there. Wow, um, he's rich. Kanye West. <laughs> he's rich. Know something. Rich people live in Montana for tax purposes. And that's why you can drive around LA and see these fancy oh, suburbans and cars with Montana license plates on them. Oh, I didn't know that. Cool. He's f- rich. Well. Giddy up. <laughs> God, your dad should not worry. <laughs> also, he basically does the same thing as my dad. He's a CFA. So, like, he, my dad's a CFA. And they're both the exact same height, six foot two and three quarters, which is very weird. <sighs> And then also they're both the youngest child of with four older siblings. You're dating your dad. I, and yeah, but they say creepy. that that's a thing. Like you I know, always end like, up dating your one of your parents. That's like freaking weird. Wow. Yeah. So he lives with 15 dogs? Wow. They have that much property in LA. He's got to be rich, Max. <laughs> okay. He could fund your it's cookie about, business. It's not about that. <laughs> it's not about that. He's cool. I mean, Jesus. <laughs> Feel that. <laughs> like, what is that? Yeah. No, but he sent me he sent me a giant bouquet of, of roses for our jokingly one week anniversary. And uh, the card was like, Olivia, like, I feel like I've known you for or no, it, it's so crazy. It feels like it's only been a week. Happy anniversary. <laughs> <laughs> That's really, was really funny. Cute. Yeah. I like this for you. Mm-hmm. Congratulations. Thanks. Have you been writing songs about it? Or or are you just too consumed with his company that you have no time to write? I wrote a song about kind of the situation of, like, realizing that you deserve better. (laughs) Like, you're deserving someone like that. I don't know. It's it's kind of it's kind of about him and kind of just about, like, I don't know, just like the, the realization of. Maybe maybe I don't want just like a stupid situation ship, even though it's fun and I've always enjoyed it in the past and like it's no drama. Maybe I could want someone that like treats me 
Nice. All my friends are like so shocked. They're like, Olivia, you deserve this. Like you've never had anything like this before. Because normally when guys are super nice to me, I don't like them, but I actually like him, which is like just. That's how you know. Yeah. Would you say he's the opposite of Logan? It's not the opposite of Logan. They're both really smart and funny and cool, but he's just like a gentleman. Like it's never, I've never, I don't know, I've never experienced anything like this in my life. So. Happy for you. Thanks. You deserve good things. Watch next time I come in. I'm like, he was an asshole. (laughs) (laughs) I have a whole album. (laughs) I mean, that's great too.